You guys getting this message every time you turn your truck on? Yep, so am I. Let's fix it. Your problem is right here. It's your brake controller switch, which is shot. And I just scored a brand new one for less than 25 bucks. Let me show you how to throw it in. Now this is a Chevy Suburban LTZ. It's the models from 2007 to 2014. So if you have a Silverado or a GMC Sierra, it's gonna be a little different. First thing I do here is pop the fuels panel cover off. And then underneath this panel here, there's gonna be two Phillips head screws. There's gonna be one right on top of your parking brake right there. And then one underneath right here. And then you're gonna pop this panel out. There should be several clips, but if you grab it right on the top and give it a pull, should pop right out. And then you just pull this panel down and you can access your switch right here. So here's your switch right here. So just unplug this connector. And then all I did here was took a needle nose plier and pried this flat back on this side and the other side and <laughs> the switch falls right through. Now it's funny, here's the new OEM one that I bought on eBay. Here's the one that I just took out of my Chevy, made in China, probably why it wasn't working. And then installation, you just reverse process. You feed your new switch through and it should click right into place. And go ahead and plug in your connector and then just reverse process, button everything up opposite the way you took it apart. And here we go. There you have it, no more warning light. Well, there you have it, guys. That's how to fix the trailer brake warning light on a Chevy Suburban, Tahoe, Yukon, Silverado, Sierra, any variant of GM vehicles. Thank you for watching.